Hi, and welcome back to the Mr. Brad Warden Show. And I am a little nervous today. So, as I explained earlier, there was uh, an unnamed challenge by an anonymous person. And as I speak right now, my camera person's covering her nose and I am like having a hard time breathing and talking. Because even in the bag, this is so potent. Do not breathe when you take that into your mouth. Oh, oh I'm struggling already. I haven't even opened the other bag. These are claimed to be, nobody's ever eaten one of these ever, ever. Claimed to be either on the same level or stronger than the Curse of the Four Horsemen made with all kinds of interesting things. Okay, from the inside of the bag, you can, if you are here, you can smell how potent this is, just emulating. And it's four of them, and you can just see the layers even coming off of, like, reaper powder and other things. Um, I intend today, I'm probably only eating one, just to compare it. Now, when I tried the Curse of Four Horsemen um, last year, um, I was able to eat two, and then the first one put me eventually to probably like a level seven or eight. Once I hit eight two, it put me to a ten. So by eating one of these, and I don't know if I dare even eat two. I guess we'll see what happens. Uh, <clears throat> Good luck. I think we'll this see. might be worse because it's like, it looks like, I think, didn't they say it was a gummy? Oh. It's, I, it's like, I can't even. It smells oh. so bad. Oh. It's like I can't plug my, it's like the powder might nail me before, oh. <laughs> oh. Look at this. Like oh my word, it's like falling off of it. Oh. Oh my, can I get Oh, oh this it? is, this is, I mean, <laughs> and this is just the outside. <laughs> okay, this is like, this is like, uh, like the Death Nuts or the Chibater 2.0, like on steroids. Oh. Good luck. I am so, I, I, I'm going to be honest with you, I am so scared. <laughs> like, even as a chili head, I am scared. From what I've heard about this, and the making of it, and what it, and it's hard. It's hard? On the outside, yeah. Like, I'm squeezing it. Oh my, oh boy. Oh. I don't even know what to say. Well, ooh, oh. Ooh, ooh, okay. All right, here we go. Can you even chew it? Oh. 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 Are you okay? You might want to push your sleeves. Your sleeves are, well, maybe don't touch your sleeves. Don't touch anything. Don't touch your eyes. Can you chew it? Is it chewy? Oh. Oh. Oh! Oh! Is it spicy? <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> Sorry. Oh! I shouldn't laugh, but your reaction is hilarious. Oh! Careful. Just be. Just take your time. Take your time. Do you need some? It's okay. Because I don't want you to choke on it either. Oh my goodness. Is it spicy? <laughs> How spicy is that? <sighs> How spicy? Are you okay? Wait, are you okay for real? Your eyes are turning bloodshot. Like, I'm a little scared actually. <sighs> Careful. Careful, don't breathe in too much. I don't want you to breathe that powder in. Oh. 
<sighs> careful, you got this. Just be careful. Be careful with breathing in so hard. I don't want that going into your lungs. Are you okay for real? <sighs> the chewing is gonna probably kill you. Oh man. You okay? Oh. You okay? Potentially, I don't know how many Scovilles or how much Carolina, like, I don't know what it, any of this is. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, you're shaking. Don't touch your face. Because you're just spreading fabrication everywhere. I can't help that. Oh, I'm sorry. Are you okay? You okay? Talk to me. Oh, What's going on? <coughs> Careful. Let's go. Ooh, ooh. You okay? <sighs> on a scale of one to ten, what's your scale? A ten. Food, so you're gonna break our table. Maybe this wasn't a smart choice. I don't recommend this to anybody. Okay, it's gotta come down eventually. Give me a moment. Think happy thoughts. Are you going to be okay, for real? Are you scaring, you're actually scaring me a little bit. Can you go get your dad some um, clinics or some tissue, please? Get right away. <laughs> don't, don't put it on the Reaper powder, though. Give it to me. There's a bag there if you need to put it in a bag. Are you coming down at all? No. Try 
Try to relax. Relax. Try to relax. Relax your breathing. coming down at all? It's not coming down at all? Are you still at a 10? Not very close. Was it a 10 to begin with? Did you get to a 10? Or above a 10? Oh. 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 Does bonding help? Do you need something? Uh, uh, I need a bail. What? I need a bail. Okay, bail. Bye. Oh, that challenge is from the depths of HE double hockey stick for sure. My mouth is still burning. My throat's burning. My chest is burning. This is five to ten minutes after. It just hardly comes down. Might be like a seven or eight still. Was it worse than the curse of the four horsemen? Yes, per one, yes. So what was the, what was happening during the process of eating that? Just tell me what happened like initially when you put it in your mouth. The heat didn't kick in right away. Tons of reaper powder. Then it was chewy. Extremely chewy. From what I heard, the chewy part, reaper powder, was strongly infused into that. And when I chewed through, it exploded tons of reaper powder from the inside into my mouth. It coated my mouth. Actually, I had to wipe my mouth out. Super hard to chew through. The chewing process took me a few minutes. If you go back to the video, <coughs> I'm still at probably about a seven. Everything burns. Per one item of that. It's probably worse than the Curse of Four Horsemen. I'm still slightly endorphin rushing. I mean, I'm probably about 10 minutes out from the challenge. Oh. I would say it's harder to get through. I'm probably harder, either that or at the same level, but just harder to get through because of the consistency of it. And that was just one. Another three there. I wouldn't even want to attempt another one. And that was... Uh, <coughs> and that was with training with Reaper Powder. The claim is it has just as much Reaper Powder in there as one of the Curse of Four Horsemen. Oh. I think it probably has more even. I don't know. It was probably estimated to be at about the same level. It's slowly coming down now though. The chewing part probably really killed you. The chewing part and then the coating of the mouth and then the gummy part getting stuck in all your teeth. 
and then the coating of the reaper coated your mouth. Uh, and there was just so much reaper and so much gummy. I mean, I still have a caught in my mouth a little bit. Um, well, that was good training. Yeah. Yeah. And now to wait out to see what the stomach... Now my heat level is probably down to about 4 or 5. Going yeah, close to 15 minutes out. So it'll come back down. But it was unbearably bad at the time. Put me at a ton by the time I chewed through it and swallowed it. This was the unknown challenge. Um, didn't really have a name. It was made by one of the viewers to train and burn me. It did. Be a crazy burn for any chili head. Eat one of those a day and you'll be good. <sighs> Uh, some people as of late have been questioning my tolerance, but that is on top line with anything or hotter than anything individually that I've ever done. If you were to eat four of those, you'd be a nightmare even thinking about it. All right, well, I've survived this barely. We'll have to see the stomach aftermath. I'll update you on that later. And we'll see you next time on the Mr. Bradborn Show.